I wanted to uh, tell you about some developments about the Botox for MS Tremor project that we have been conducting over the last few years here at the Melbourne Brain Centre and also at the Royal Melbourne Hospital. We uh, were extremely fortunate to receive some funding from the NHMRC last year which has enabled us to set up a new project looking at Botox injections in the arm for people with MS and arm shaking or tremor. Now, we did an update video about this last year, but I think many of you may be aware that we have trialed this a number of years ago in a small group of people with MS, um, where we injected their arms with Botox or water injections and followed them up closely over a six month period. This particular study showed about a 30 to 40% improvement in arm tremor for many people who received the treatment. This was also very exciting because for many patients this actually translated into an uh, improvement in their physical um, ability to drink water from a cup or even to write. Um, and we have been trying to set up a larger study for, for quite some time. We are now in the position that we can finally start recruiting for this study. We are looking at recruiting about 100 patients from all over Melbourne and everybody will be studied here at the Melbourne Brain Centre and at the Royal Melbourne Hospital. People will be, be given um, a chance to receive Botox or a water injection and um, after six months everybody will be given the chance to receive the Botox injection. What is also very exciting about this study is a collaboration with the University of Melbourne Neuroimaging Department um, where we will be using the new 7 Tesla MRI scanner that was installed at the university last year to look at brain characteristics um, that may help us understand why some people with MS get tremor and um, um, look at different patterns of brain injury in people with tremor and MS and those with MS that do not develop a tremor. So we will be um, providing some um, information on who you can contact if you're interested in participating um, and um, hopefully we will have some results of the study um, for you in a year or two.